Hello there, I just got back from a trip to the city of London and I thought I would make a video about my top seven photography spots in London. I'm not a local, so I don't know all the secret spots, but if this is your first time visiting the city, I think this might be a great place to start for you since I've been there photographing a few times. The first is just the River Thames area. Honestly, if you just go down into the city, there are a bunch of walkways along the river there. Go in the evening when the light is beautiful. There's a ton of interesting people, lots of interesting scenery. You really can't go wrong in that whole general area. It's kind of an obvious one, but that's probably where I would start if I was first just trying to get a feel for the city. The second would be St. Paul's Cathedral, which is absolutely beautiful. You can walk around, um, and get photos of it from a number of different angles. I would encourage you actually to not look on Instagram because there are lots of photos of this particular location. Just go there with fresh eyes and a clear mind and just wander around that whole area and you'll get some, I think, amazing shots of both the cathedral and the surrounding buildings and people. Number three would be Millennium Bridge, which honestly is just a place you should visit anyway. It's really a, it's a really interesting piece of engineering and it's highly used by people just going back and forth across the river and so you can get a lot of interesting shots of both the bridge and also the people who are crossing it. Really we could call out all the bridges because all the bridges that cross the river have their own sort of interesting feel to them so you could spend the whole day just capturing those. The next one isn't specifically a location so much as just the architecture in general. London is a very photogenic city and there's interesting architecture everywhere so if you're into that kind of photography just wander around, go down to the river, and wander through all kinds of neighborhoods, and you'll see really interesting buildings and really interesting things to take photographs of. Number five would be the Shard Observatory deck. I, this one's a little bit tough because if you go, I think, in the winter, then you can stay up long enough to see sunset and get some photos at night. I happened to go in the late spring, and they kicked us out, I think, around 7 p.m., and sunset was until 8.30. So I only got photographs of stuff during the day, which was sort of interesting, but honestly, unless you can go uh, up there to get some interesting night photography, I don't know that I would recommend it, but it was definitely an interesting viewpoint to see the city from, and it's a really cool building, so photographs of the Shard are interesting in and of themselves. Number six would be the Tower Bridge. For me, this is one of the most iconic bridges that crosses the Thames. It's just a really interesting structure. I would recommend you go in the evening or at night because I think the night photography of that location, the bridge is lit up really in a really interesting way and it's a, a cool thing to see. Lastly, and the one I'll leave you with is actually not a specific location, but just the red buses in London. The, the public transit buses are just the most obvious subject there. They're red obviously and the colors are loud and they're absolutely everywhere and there's a ton of places to get photographs of them and they, they just make really interesting photos. So as you're wandering around the city, just, in, just try and get as many shots of those as you can because they're very iconic and very interesting to look at. All right, that's it. Those are my top seven spots for photographs in London. Hope you enjoyed it. We'll catch you in the next one.